Away specialist Saint-Étienne travelled north to rock-bottom Metz, hoping to maintain their challenge for European football next season. With no win since November the 1st and just four points from their last 16 games, Metz's situation looks desperate and coach Albert Cartier's mood at the Stade saint symphorien would not have been helped by seeing his side squander early chances. Kevin Lejeune shot wide after just six minutes while Sylvain Marchal scooped his effort high and wide from a corner. Saint-Étienne were not so profligate as Romain Hamouma tricked his way down the right and his scuffed cross found Max Gradel to fire into the roof of the net on 38 minutes. It was the Ivorian forward's eighth goal of the season. Hamouma doing exceptionally well to pick out his teammate eight yards from goal. Hamouma turned provider again as Mevlut Erding sprang a misfunctioning offside trap and rounded goalkeeper Anthony Mfa Mezui before slotting into the empty net. Two goals to the good at half-time, Christophe Galtier could feel confident his side would be closing the gap on fourth-placed Monaco to just a single point. Umfa Mzui made a spectacular stop at the start of the second period from Francois Clerc to keep his side in touch. Before Lejeune gave them a lifeline, with a stunning strike out of absolutely nothing that scorched into the top corner, giving Stefan Ruffier no chance. Metz felt they should have had a penalty for this handball by Fabien Lemoyne. but the referee awarded a free kick. And Ruffier plunged to his right to keep out Bounassar's curling effort that looked set to creep inside the near post. Saint-Étienne were quick to punish their hosts as Hamouma picked out Johan Molo's run and the substitute bobbled a shot past Umfa Mezui, courtesy of a slight deflection. Metz did get a penalty in injury time as Benjamin Cornier was harshly penalised for handball. Yeni Ungbakoto smacked the spot kick straight down the middle, but it proved too little too late. Saint Etienne remain on course for European football, while Metz looks certain to return to Ligue 2 as their impending relegation creeps ever closer, now sitting 10 points from safety.